Yo, yo, what's happening? Another day, another BTS vlog. Uh, I am currently on my way to downtown San Diego to film a few interviews. I'll explain a little bit more about this project uh, in a bit. But first, I'm going to meet with a friend to transfer some media. So like I mentioned in a previous vlog episode, I contracted my friend Jordan uh, to film this conference for me. And he pretty much specializes in wedding filmmaking. But if you could do weddings, you could probably do anything in my opinion. So these are some examples of some of the clips that we were able to produce. I actually just sent this edit in recently. I sent him a first draft and they loved it so much that they didn't want any sort of revisions. So I like that too. It makes life so much easier. And uh, yeah, I think uh, this came out pretty damn good. I think it's time for me to start looking into getting a more decent cart for all my gear. As you can see, it barely fits in there. A couple episodes back, I had a film at this exact ClickUp office in downtown San Diego. Not necessarily for ClickUp, but through a third party. But the people from ClickUp saw the production and got my contact info. A few days later, I got a random text message and said, hey, this is such and such from ClickUp. Are you by chance available to film some talking head content within the next couple of days? We got some colleagues from all over the country that are going to be in San Diego just for a little bit. So we need some content. And luckily for them, I was available. So two days later, I was at their office and filming some content for them. So this is a pretty light setup, just the A7S III with the 85 G Master lens and just one light source, the Amaran 200X. And I also have the Rode Wireless Go mics uh, connected to a LAV. And yeah, this is pretty much what it looks like. Very simple, uh, nothing too crazy. So here's a quick example of the s Lock 3 footage. Throw a conversion LUT on top of a little bit of grading. Uh, it's not my favorite look ever. Um, and I think it's because of my lights. I need a stronger light. I have the 200 Amaran X, which is an amazing light. It's gotten me through so many shoots, but once I knew I was going to film towards the window, I knew that my light was simply just not strong enough. And I was hoping that the talent would be fast enough to get through these recordings uh, because that sun kept getting closer and closer towards that window and it kept getting brighter and brighter throughout each talent. But overall, they were very happy and satisfied with the material that I was able to produce for them. I just strictly just filmed and they have their own editors, so everything worked out great. Uh, but I need to start uh, thinking about investing in more quality gear. So I need to do a little bit of homework and figure out what's the next light I need to uh, purchase. But if you guys have any recommendations on a light that I should look into, definitely leave them in the comments below. I'll definitely check that out and appreciate that. But that's pretty much it. I'm pretty much dumping all the footage to their hard drive. And yeah, that is a wrap.